Rodney Dangerfield, American comedian and actor, Rodney Dangerfield born, the 22nd of November 1921, Deer Park, New York, United States. Rodney Dangerfield died, the 5th of October 2004, Ronald Reagan UCLA Medical Center, Los Angeles, California, United States. Rodney Dangerfield spouse, Joan Child M., 1993-2004, Joyce Indig M., 1963-1970, Joyce Indig M., 1951-1961, Rodney Dangerfield Place of Burial, Pierce Brothers Westwood Village Memorial Park and Mortuary, Los Angeles, California, United States. Rodney Dangerfield Children, Melanie Roy Friedman, Brian Roy, Rodney Dangerfield Parents, Dottie Teitelbaum, Phil Roy, Rodney Dangerfield Net Worth $20 Million USD, Rodney Dangerfield About, Jack Roy, better known by the pseudonym Rodney Dangerfield, was an American stand-up comedian, actor, screenwriter, and producer. He was known for his self-deprecating one-liner humor, his catchphrase, I don't get no respect, and his monologues on that theme. What was Rodney Dangerfield's net worth? Rodney Dangerfield was an American comedian and actor who had a net worth of $20 million at the time of his death in 2004. After adjusting for inflation that's the same as around $30 million in today's dollars. Rodney Dangerfield was best known for his mordant one-liners and borscht belt monologues. After getting his start performing stand-up in the Catskills, he rose in popularity as a go-to guest on late-night talk shows over the course of the 1960s and 70s, and then as a headlining Las Vegas act. Along with his iconic catchphrase, I don't get no respect, Dangerfield is widely remembered for his starring role in the 1980 golf comedy, Caddyshack. Rodney Dangerfield Early Life and Career Beginnings Rodney Dangerfield was born as Jacob Rodney Cohen in 1921 in the village of Babylon, on Long Island, New York. His mother was Dorothy Teitelbaum, who came from the Austro-Hungarian Empire, and Philip Cohen, a vaudevillian performer, both were Jewish. Much strife came from the fact that Philip was rarely home, and Dorothy seldom showed her son affection. When his father abandoned the family, Dangerfield moved with his sister and mother to Kew Gardens, Queens, where he attended Richmond Hill High School, graduating in 1939. Dangerfield began writing for stand-up comedians at the age of 15 while performing at a resort in Ellenville, New York. After legally changing his name to Jack Roy, he struggled economically for almost a decade, taking odd jobs as a singing waiter and an aluminum siding salesman. Dangerfield's career rehabilitation took place in the early 1960s, after returning to the stage to perform at resorts in the Catskill Mountains. Still struggling to find success, he realized he needed to cultivate an artistic persona that would make him stand out in the world of comedy. He thus adopted the name Rodney Dangerfield, which had previously been used for a character on a Jack Benny radio program in the 1940s. Dangerfield was greatly inspired by this character, who had similarly received meager respect from society. Rodney Dangerfield Personal Life and Death Rodney Dangerfield was twice wed to Joyce Indig, first from 1951 to 1961, and then from 1963 to 1970. They had two children, Brian Roy and Melanie Roy Friedman. In 1993, he married Joan Child. Rodney and Joan Dangerfield remained together until his death. Dangerfield passed away in 2004, three years after suffering a mild heart attack during a stand-up routine on The Tonight Show, and almost two months after undergoing heart valve replacement surgery. He was 82. Dangerfield is buried in Los Angeles Westwood Village Memorial Park Cemetery, with his headstone epitaph reading, in characteristically self-deprecating fashion, there goes